Ladies and gentlemen, introducing to you one more time, fighting out of the red corner from Stockport Boxing Gym. Give it up for Martin Gavin. And opponent standing across the cage in the blue corner from Blue Wave MMA. Put your hands together for Jake Nichols. This mixed martial arts contest will be fought over three three minute rounds. Your referee in charge of the action, Mr. AJ Jeffrey. So AJ Jeffrey's a busy man tonight. He's back with the man in the middle for this fight between Martin Gavin, Stockport Boxing Gym in the red corner, and Jake Nichols from Blue Wave MMA in the blue corner, who danced his way to the cage. I love this kid, Dean. He's got everything you need to be a star in this game, and let's see what he can do here tonight. Jake Nichols won by the first ever helicopter punch I ever saw. Uh, his first MMA fight, he knocked Shea Veal out. And here we go, round number one. Gavin coming out aggressive. Walks straight into a shot from Jake Nichols. And Nichols is really a prodigy, he's a phenom. And you're going to see his work unfold right here in the contender's cage. You can see he's very light on his feet. Superman punch lands on Gavin, follows up with the leg kick. Nichols very aware of where he is in space. He's able to bounce in and out of range whilst throwing techniques. Absolutely. And he's backing Gavin up here without him even realising he's doing it. Gavin's looking kind of wild. Slightly uneducated in his rushes towards Nichols. He's probably feeling a bit baffled in there at the moment. Looks for the takedown. Nichols spins that. Gavin now on top. That was excellent. In that transition there, in the scrambles, Gavin realised that he needs to end up on this top position. He's got to be careful about getting his back taken here. Nichols is popping out. Got a standoff here. Nichols looking to take the back. Gavin desperately holding onto that head of Nichols. That's like an old school. Headlock position, we're headed with the arm in, he's got to be careful because you're going to see Nichols pop out into a more dominant position. It's a full mount now for Nichols and he's going to drop some bombs. He pulls us to... Look at this, he's a showman, now he's going to town on Gavin. Got in heavy shots, Gavin's got to move, that's it! The fight is over and Jack Nichols moves to 3-0. and What an impressive talent this young man is, and the back flip as well! Fantastic from Nichols. Beautiful work there from Nichols. He really showcased his skills and he was patient in that scramble. Gavin gave up the mount and those punches were solid. We could feel them from the cage into the floor here at the concrete position. Excellent display of power and skills for MMA there. Absolutely, and uh, definitely a bit of showboating there when he took the full mount. He paused to kind of wipe his nose <laughs> and then just started throwing down bombs from the top. You've got to say, this kid is really going to be one to watch. He's 3-0 and now, MMA. He's 1-0. and He's fought K1 as well. So he just fights. Fight. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. He fights all sorts of styles. He's very accomplished. And we're going to throw it into the cage for the official decision here from MC Tom Vince. I think he's just trying to combat a snake Fighters, there. fighters, fighters, fighters. Fighters to the centre of the cage, please. Ladies and gents, let's hear it for both these young guys here in the cage. Right, ladies and gentlemen, we do have a winner, and I think he might do a celebration for us one more time if you shout loud enough. Let's hear it in the blue corner. Give it up for Jake Nicholas. Ladies and gents, give it up for Martin Gavin. So as we were saying, Dean, very impressive showing there from young Jake Nichols. You've got to be impressed as a fighter, as a BJJ guy as well, um, with what you saw from that young man. And that's what we spoke about before he came out. We spoke about his ability to merge all these...